Welcome to the Earl Haig 2012 Bioscience Fair. <laughs> Tested for three natural antiseptics, and they are pineapple juice, pure um, garlic juice, also pure, and a uh, honey solution that we made ourselves. And we discovered that the pineapple juice was the most effective at killing bacteria. Our experiment aims at disproving the myth that goldfish memory is only three seconds long. We use classical conditioning to disprove this myth. P.S. Eating more goldfish does not improve your memory. So it's actually I like it. Well, this is what we asked our participants. That's what we had said after the community. Okay, so for our project, we did a comparison of natural versus commercial herbicides and the effects on grass grow. So I spent an entire month watching grass grow. It was so exciting. It was exciting. So our project is on the effects of different conditions on the rates of metabolism in these cells. And the results of this experiment were that the minus air and sucrose trials provided the highest average metabolism rate in these cells. Support organic soy milk and you support a healthier world. <laughs> Our project is the effects of chemicals in bottled water on cell growth comparing between tap water and bottled water. So we're taking a look at tap water and yeast and Evian and yeast, which one would you rather drink? I like meat, but what's in it? What's in my meat? If you don't fully cook your meat, you're insane. Okay, so for our project, we experimented with uh, the bacteria strand that's known to cause um, the skin disease acne vulgaris, um, called Propioni bacterium acne. And we found that antibiotics work much better than natural remedies in inhibiting uh, bacteria. So what we wanted to do was see if using highlighters while we studied would help us get higher marks. And our results show that they don't. So save your money and don't waste your money on honey. So design something that would transmit the least amount of bacteria and then advertise it because every, right now everyone's scared of bacteria and viruses. Yep. So if we market that, there's going to be this great. Oh! I'll give you your Hi, Mr. Caruana. Say, for really great physics lessons, go to physicseh.com. Really great physics lessons, go to physicseh.com. Oh, I'm just waking up. Shouldn't you be working on your project? <laughs> we should. Theoretically, yes. So, is organic farming really worth bang for your buck versus conventional farming? Our results found that
that organic farming in the long run does give you more for your dollar. And in addition, we found a way that you can for sure tell if produce is organic by the barcode. If it starts with a nine and has five digits, then you know that the produce you are consuming is organic. Versus if it does not start with a nine and is only four digits, it's conventionally farmed. Microscopic study of lysosome unfolding. Come on, the title itself is with 9 out of 10. The written on the side of the flower package, if you can find the correlation. Yeah. The numbers are similar but not the same in application. We did the effect of human hormones on plants. Oh, hello, welcome to Acne Attack. That's Tommy. We um, saw that. Acetic acid is used to catalyze the uh, acid hydrolysis reaction to break up the branches of the immunopectin. So that's what's happening right now. The solution in there is made of biopolymers, which is the starch. Corn starch. Yeah. And then acetic acid. Acetic acid. So it's oh. Foil, so we got a lot of irregular shapes. It's really fluid. Go. Our project is the effect of magnetism on the cricket's sense of direction. We found that it does have an effect and it slows them down. Thanks for coming to the Earl Hag Biology Fair. We hope you enjoy all the different projects.